To solve this system of equations by substitution, since our first equation tells us that y equals one-third x minus one, we can substitute this one-third x minus one in for the y in our second equation, which becomes three x minus two times parentheses one-third x minus one equals four. Now we can solve for x by first distributing this negative two through the parentheses to get three x minus two-thirds x plus two equals four. And now we need to get rid of the fraction by multiplying both sides of the equation by three to get 9x minus 2x plus 6 equals 12. Simplifying the left side, we have 7x plus 6 equals 12. Subtract 6 from both sides. And 7x equals 6. To solve for x, we divide both sides by 7. And notice that x equals the fraction six sevenths. To find y, we plug six sevenths back in for x in our first equation to get y equals one third times parentheses six sevenths minus one. Notice that to solve for y, we're going to need to deal with some fractions. Simplifying the right side of this equation, we have one-third times six-sevenths, so we can cross-cancel the six and the three to two and one. We have one times two, which is two, and one times seven, which is seven. So y equals two-sevenths minus one, which can be thought of as y equals two-sevenths minus one over one. And we can simplify this by finding a common denominator of 7. So multiply top and bottom of the second fraction by 7 to get y equals 2 sevenths minus 7 sevenths, which simplifies to y equals negative 5 sevenths. So the solution to this system is 6 sevenths, negative 5 sevenths.